Welcome to my channel. Today you will understand the basic properties of electric charge. There are two kinds of electric charges, positive and negative. Like charges repel each other, whereas unlike charges attract each other. Now another property of electric charge is that electric charge is conserved. Positively charged particles are called protons. Uncharged particles are called neutrons, whereas negatively charged particles are called electrons that revolve around the nucleus in elliptical orbits. Net charge in a system is the same before and after any interaction within the system. Condition is that there is no exchange of mass and energy during any interaction or no external charge enters or leaves the system during the interaction. This is the principle of conservation of electric charge. In other words, charge conservation is the principle that the total electric charge in an isolated system never changes. The net quantity of electric charge, the amount of positive charge minus the amount of negative charge in the universe is conserved. Another important property of electric charge is that electric charge is quantized. That is, when an object is charged, its charge is always a multiple of a fundamental unit of charge. The unit of charge is coulomb or charge is measured in coulomb. The fundamental unit of charge E is the magnitude of the charge of a single electron or proton and its value is 1.6 into 10 raised to the power minus 19 coulomb. Now quantization of charge means that Q, the net charge in the universe will be equal to Ne where n is an integer and its value is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and so on. Positive and negative signs indicate that we will consider a positive charge in case of protons, whereas in case of electrons, we will apply a negative sign. Now this is the Millikan's oil drop experimental arrangement to find out the charge on electron and it was proved by Millikan and Harvey Fletcher in 1909 that electric charge is conserved. Millikan in 1923 was awarded the Nobel Prize for this revolutionary findings of conservation of electric charge. Now here I have given a summary of all the basic properties of electric charge once again. Thank you for watching.